Have you ever heard of the Pink and White Terraces? Well, in the holidays, I went to Rotorua and went to the Thermal Wonderland, where there was orange, green, red, yellow, all sorts of formations, even mud pools. And my dad said, did you know there used to be Pink and White Terraces? Pink and White Terraces were located on Lake Rotorua in Rotorua. They covered three hectares and descended 30 metres. The terraces were the largest and most beautiful aspect of New Zealand. They were made of geothermally heated water containing large amounts of silica regularly spouting out of the geyser and cascaded downhill leaving thick pink blankets of th thick pink and white blankets of silica. The tourists arrived from all over the world to see the formations. People bathed in the hot mineral pools. The pink terraces were known as O2 Kapurangi, which meant the fountains of the clouded sky. Many tourists were taken to visit the terraces by local Maoris in whale boats or canoes. They were known as the eighth wonder of the world. At around 3 a.m. on the 10th of June, 8086, Mount Terror exploded with tragic consequences. The volcano shot out hot red mud and hot red boulders and huge clouds of black ash. People from the fireways Auckland and Christchurch heard blasts. Surrounding villages were blanketed in ash and mud. The eruption destroyed both Lake Rotomanahana and the pink and white terraces. The eighth wonder of the world was lost forever. Approximately 120 people were killed during the eruption, burying several villages, including the Maori and European settlement of Te Whairua. Many locals lost their jobs and the tourist trade dried up. Lots of new geothermal features were created by the eruption, including the wine the Waimangu geyser, the largest in the world. This geyser was seen to erupt almost half a kilometre high. Fortunately, it was destroyed in a landslide in 1904. After some years, the crater by the eruption of Mount Tauwea filled with water and formed a new lake, 30 metres higher and much larger than the old lake. There are similar places still in the world today. Yellowstone in the US has the highest concentration of geothermal activity with over 200 geysers erupting each year. In Pomukela in Turkey, there are uh, formations similar to the pink white terraces. They built hotels on the terraces and people were allowed to ride motorbikes up and down there. And Waiotapu in Rotorua has similar structures that appear to be forming. In one night, the most beautiful aspect of New Zealand was destroyed. Just imagine what it would mean to New Zealand if the eighth wonder of the world still existed.